I think. Let's do this. That was a little bit easier. Didn't have to save stuff. See? Doing this on. Oh, no. Play round one. Just play through round one and play through losers round one as well. So wait on losers round two, but play, um, play through um, losers round one. Doing that, we'll be doing that. Technically, in a seven player tournament, everyone's top eight. So we're, we're gonna ignore that, we're gonna ignore that because we're about to watch Knuckfist PC's Akuma versus Kirby Poppins PC. What Kirby Poppins PC changing that name on me? Oh, maybe that's weird. It's not winner's semifinals yet. That's next round. Next round. Meanwhile, Kirby Poppins is uh, not doing too well against uh, against the Kuma. It is a week. It is a week one calling though. It's a week one calling. I do have to say, um, first thoughts. First thoughts on it is that. He's got the wrong outfit. As much as I love the normal outfit, the figure skater one is top tier. So you're, you're really missing out on some uh, some skill right there. Other than that, it seems like he just doesn't know the footsies answers to the buttons that Nuckfist is pressing right now. So he's just having a lot of time. Like he doesn't know his anti ears versus the uh, versus the change jump arcs and such, and he. Uh, he doesn't know how to be a what's impressing the challenging Akuma's moving. Like you see, he's trying things. Like he's trying like the jab and such. But oh, with the taunt finisher, Nuckfist PC feeling himself, thinking, Akuma thinking that he's a uh, that he's a um, who? What do you call it? Tokido. He's uh, probably is Tokido at final rounds. I don't remember seeing him play any games, but maybe, maybe uh, Nekfist saw that a little bit and, you know, got excited. Going back to the menu. Takedo. Takedo is busy crying. You think you think you think uh, Tokido's taking um, taking the loss a little hard? The Daigo, Daigo loss just a little bit hard. Let's do this. It only really seemed that way. It only really seemed that way. But I mean, like. Well, I think I think players, and especially Japanese players, I think they put too much stock in um, in first to tens because it's like that's like the true test of skill or something like that. But it, it's just a different format, you know. It's like I feel like I feel it's like comparing a uh, you know a sprint to a marathon. It's like like you know like if you can't you can't be like oh man that sprinter lost them. Lost in the marathon, he's clearly a bad player. He's not that good. That's... I don't feel that's right. Anyways. We're back in this. Kirby popping sticking with that Colleen. Dedicated to trying to learn all these different characters. But, uh, like I said, yeah, you see that he just does not have a really good answer to the neutral game or the air fireballs or the dive kicks. But, um,. Fighting back a little bit. Ooh. Just throws that out there. Probably a buffer that he just missed the first input in, and that's gonna That's gonna lose him the round. He started a little bit of offense there, but um, a little bit of slip of the hands and uh He's sitting on the edge of losers bracket. Oh, not ready for the uh GXD inflate, not ready to anti air. Oh, ducking the throw. Catch 
Imagine! Imagine not doing the second part of that sweep. And uh, oh, he's getting he's getting something started. Ooh, crush counter. And to feature two combos, not enough to stun. Working on it. Goes for the throw, but goes a little bit too early. Loses out on the stun. Is he going to be able to recover here? Throwing out those buttons. Checking uh, Nuckfist's movement. Just blocking, just blocking. Tries to jump out, but gets hit by the air fireball. Ooh, gets that throw. Tries for the overhead, but Nuckfist sniffs it out. Tries to slide under, or dash under the air fireballs, but probably forgot that Colleen uh, has that. You know, slide dash and gets punished on the, uh, the landing frames. That Kirby gets knocked down to losers. Neck fist moves on.